In Gijou province, abundant surface water has sculpted dramatic karst cliffs. Precipitation and omnipresent heat sources nurture luxuriant vegetation. With numerous streams and treacherous ridges, the rugged terrain proves to be a formidable obstacle that deters most animals. However, such features are welcomed by nimble valley rangers who have adapted to the cliffs and regard them as comfortable and safe dwellings. In Liu Pan Shui City's Shui Cheng District, the Yenzhong Francois Langer Nature Reserve is dominated by dense forests that host troops of its namesake primate. Some 20 groups live here, totaling 100 plus individuals. The varied landform offers the Francois Langers diverse living environments. These gregarious creatures live in troops of three to ten. For them, the presence of partners is vital. Watching each other's back is how these langurs have managed to survive in the dangerous woodlands. Other than feeding, socializing is also a major activity. The stretch of open cliffs serves the troops as a wonderful assembly hall. On a warm afternoon, this youngster, who has recently shed its lanugo hair, is so exuberant and eager to explore farther afield. The formidable cliffs and luxuriant branches prove no obstacle to the young one. The parties at the assembly spot are all too familiar. While the siblings chase and frolic, the precipitous cliffs turn into the bold cubs' favorite playground. When tired, they gather on a flat ledge and start grooming to deepen their mutual bonds. With insatiable curiosity, the thrilled young one observes every member's mannerisms. This female langur has just become a mother ahead of autumn. The newborn is covered with visually striking golden baby fur. This serves as a badge of protection by reminding the adult langurs of this vulnerable infant. To keep her baby out of sight, the mother langur gives up the spot commanding the best view and perches in the trees. Here, the dense foliage shields them from unwanted attention.